So two hits. Each of these. <laughs> Thank you, Bolt. <laughs> Go down, though. Um, 12 plus 2 is 14, halved to 7. I will um, use my bonus action shield thing to take the damage for my king. You literally fucking f- secret service leap and take the arrow in the fucking chest. Ah. Just boom. Um, you take the full 14 minus three for heavy armor, Master. Theobald, take me on as a, an apprentice. <laughs> uh, so you and Sir Theobald are like fighting live. back to back here. Yeah. Um, uh, as you leap into the fray. And then what, uh, Murph has Swirl Warden. Yes. I think, like, shout, that's a shout out. That's one really of my favorites. Sick. I think yeah. that I haven't used, but to yeah. see. Uh, Swirl Warden is very cool. Swirl Warden's dope as hell, dude. Sw- I think Swirl Warden actually has the most powerful ability in, yeah. in the game because I think, well, it's very interesting because there's, so so yeah, Theobald has the battle pop, battle pop, the broad sickle, which has that compelled dual <laughs> ability. And then uh, the, the uh, swirl warden is the sucker shield and its ability as, as a, gives a plus one, and no, I'm trying to remember. Yes, it's a plus one to armor. Yeah, it is a plus one to armor. And um, it uh, allows you to, as a reaction, move up to your speed and if you can end that movement within five feet of an ally um you can take the damage for their attack instead and like negate an attack against them and Um, isn't it specifically not an ally but a member of the rocks family i actually think it's just uh, the wording is just an ally but um uh it's one of those things where like uh play it's I don't necessarily think 5e has as many abilities that make playing a bodyguard. It's yeah. hard. It's hard to make a character that, because a lot of what happens- It just like you, takes damage and like jumps in front of people. Well, that's the thing is you can make a tank, but it's really disempowering when you're like, I've made my character into a defensive bulwark. And now what happens as a result of that is I just watch all my friends die. Like there's not a way to like lend your hit points or like lend you know like there's the protection thing but that's disadvantage on one roll mm-hmm. and, and if yeah if things are fighting like this and like we'll choose not to attack you if you're a big like gummy bear right uh, it's nice to have something to make right. them attack and especially it's like it's like yeah how do you actually mechanically represent a knight getting in someone's way and it's one of those things where because Murph's AC is so high and he has so many hit points as this character it's like making him just take the damage of the attack is almost always a good deal for him because it's like how many times is he even going to get hit in a battle you know by round three or four annabelle um is pushed under the water um i need uh okay you're gonna each roll 1d4 um you don't want a uh you're trying not to get a four, you're trying not to get a one. Zach, what if you immediately Two. die? <laughs> four. Fuck. Fuck! Um, Meet me in the milk. Theo goes in. God, that's so uh, bad. Theo is in a lot, of, I mean, everyone's in a lot of trouble. Theo's in a tremendous amount of trouble. He's wearing full plate mail. Um, these guys, so one, two, three, four, five, six, are all going to go for cumulus. That is going to be cumulus you take. Can I use Swirl Warden to try to get up into the boat? Ooh, yeah, buddy! You absolutely. <laughs> You absolute <laughs> motherfucker. How dare you use a magic item I homebrewed just for you to fuck me. All right. Yeah. Here's what's got to happen. Okay. I'm going to let you mm-hmm. decide okay. which one you want this to be. Uh, it's it's diff- swimming is normally just difficult, uh, but you don't have a swim speed, um, so it would take all of your movement to get up and just grab onto 
the boat. Uh -huh. I'm going to say you can either make a DC 25 athletics check, or you can make a DC 20 athletics check with disadvantage. Fuck. Hmm. God damn. Um, I mean... I'm... You have Sprinkle. Yeah, you know what? I'll do disadvantage. So Sprinkle's gonna cancel that out. So you've okay. gotta hit... Okay, a... so Sprinkle can help. Yeah. Sprinkle can help. Um, so you gotta hit 20 on an athletics. It's 13 or higher, right? Damn, we live in the damn box of day. Yeah, truly. Yeah. Uh, so no, this is because I'm gonna do this as well. You're trying to swim. You're in heavy armor. This is This has to matter. Okay. Um, 13 means you get to the ship and get a gauntlet on it. Okay. You get a gauntlet on it. If you fail that by 10 or more, meaning if you get a three or lower, you're gonna immediately shoot 20 feet down into the water. Jesus. Oh. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't have much of a choice. 13 or higher gets you to the boat, three or lower gets you deeper into the sea. Riz got gag dice. 15. Oh, that's a 22. Oh, oh, oh. Sprinkle! <laughs> you absolute goon! You fucker! Uh, rolls, rolls, so, rolls! Theo, you go in. Amathar, you leap to the ship, shout the command. The boat swivels. You feel yourself sinking, plummeting with your armor. You hit the mast that catches you just as Amathar gives the command to turn the ship. You are on the mast, so your sinking is slowed, and you hear a voice in the water. <laughs> um, you, how much damage did I say you took? You didn't say yet. You take, or you're about to take, 13 points of damage. Underneath the sea, Theo, you feel the yogurt entering your lungs. <gasps> Swirl Warden glows. <clears throat> A member of the House of Rocks is in danger. <gasps> Theo bursts out of the ocean, yes. uh, jumps, I'm gonna say jumps into the fucking boat, yeah. and you take 13 points of damage <laughs> yeah. as you leap in the way of the attack. <laughs> How much do I take then? Take none. <laughs> none at all? Oh wow. Theo taking that damage for you just saved his life. Oh my <laughs> god. We've met, right? <laughs> we, I was standing in the corner, I went and got some parchment. You went down when I got great the parts, memory, yet, honestly. <laughs> no, it wasn't very important at the time. Okay. Um, so wild. That's I crazy. I cannot believe that. As a reaction. I was waiting That's for so somebody to get hit near me. That moment of Swirl Warden glowing, Cumulus is a member of the royal family, and suddenly whoosh, bursting up through the water with Swirl Warden's ability. So fucking cinematic and cool. Um, and I, you know, that'll teach me for homebrewing magic items. Um, <laughs> He'd rather he die in that moment, right? <laughs> I don't care for us, folks. Brennan wanted him prefer, to die. You prefer he sing. You want to narrate his defeat. Drown in yogurt I'm on I'm telling Zach's you, birthday. he wouldn't have died. I would have jumped in. And <gasps> yeah, we would have both died myself. together. And then I would jump in and just melt in the water. You don't have to attack water. yourself. Just throw a dagger. <laughs> just a TPK. Absolutely unnecessary TPK. <laughs> well, we need I to jump in to make sure was you were okay. Into the water after the last. Another exciting episode of Dimension 20 Live <laughs> presents <laughs> Fantasy High <laughs> sophomore year. They're doing their spells! Yes, everyone gave wow. me such shit about my spells being wrong. I'm looking them all up. Uh, looking up all their spells. Turns out I don't have Ice Feast or whatever <laughs> I thought I had. Hey, nobody has Ice Feast. What the fuck is Ice Feast? It's a feast of ice. Oh, come on. Do you, you, you have a bag of ice Yeah, if you guys want to homebrew ice piece, you can. Guys, uh, welcome back to another exciting episode uh, of Dimension 20 presents Fantasy High, uh, a Fantasy High sophomore year, the continuing adventure of the bad kids. It's just for the vultures, the don't wear it against with anybody one else. one of those like, old school snow cone machines where you have to like freeze the discs and then you're like grinding it. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. she's going to go around and give everybody a dish of unseasoned ice. Great. Right. So you cast, so Kristen is going to, for the first time, mm -hmm. 
cast Ice Feast. This is a homebrewed spell from Brennan with love. Are you guys ready for yes. what we get? Ready. Mm -hmm. We each take one level of exhaustion. Great. <laughs> Interesting. And we take 1d12 cold damage. Okay. Right, this is a, a gift with love? Yeah, am I allowed love. to? Say the good I stuff know. before yeah, I I'm yeah. currently eyeing my snow cone and being that. like, I don't fit. Uh, no. You guys have a 12? Uh, I think I can't eat this. I can't I... not still. No, nah, here you yeah. go, guys. Here you go. Uh, all right, we all take seven points of damage. <laughs> okay, I might not eat it. Yeah, I'm still not You guys are cured of all diseases and poison, become immune to fire damage and being stunned. Are you make oh. all you make all con saves with advantage, okay. and your hit point maximum increases by two Give d10, me the eye. and gain that same number of hit points. It lasts for 24 hours. Okay, okay. I think a couple of us. How have we not been eating this every <laughs> day? <laughs> I, I, I don't know how many times I said you got to read ice speak. I said, I said it sounds yeah, great. Yeah, you only read the first few lines of it and we were like, oh, that's bad. Why yes, we all were on the same page. And being like, How I don't... can we cure exhaustion? A level of exhaustion. Uh, greater restoration can cure exhaustion. Which I also have in my staff. Oh, and do we... Oh, what about, um, we, are, are you bringing back K2? Have you just... K2 <laughs> could also greater restoration. I, and not even like as a joke, I do think narratively Kristen would do anything to get her back. I think in this moment, <laughs> Not even as a joke, and then a shitty and then, grin. And then a grin that face. won't, like a bad flare up. Uh, I'm gonna have K2 have casted Ice Feast if that's so okay. So it's a 60 foot grinning. fly speed. Okay. So coming in from the sky, wrapped in the, the Union Jack. Um, <laughs> uh, what is that? Uh, <laughs> Holy shit! Just holding pounds and pounds and pounds of unseasoned ice. Behold the ice face, Kavna, <laughs> and then she got more British in death. Uh, <laughs> you all. Wait, you mean she achieved uh, her true potential in death? <laughs> so, um, uh, so for all of you, immunity to fire, immunity to the stunned condition. Um, you all take one d12 cold damage, but then your HP maximum and current HP go up by two d10. Right. So you're like a little bit under a larger yeah. max. Is it? Uh, it's safe. It's, uh, it's, it's. Everyone gets the same. Front. Everyone gets the same. So you go ahead and roll two d10 for everybody. That's a five. Oh, whoops. That's a ten, baby. All right, fifteen, 15. HP max uh, and current goes up by fifteen for everybody. But you did take that seven cold damage from eating so much ice. Is that like temp <clears throat> HP or? No, it's, it's your it's your temporary maximum. Ooh. So it's not temp HP. You can healing spells can bring you back for the next twenty four hours. Such a good spell. Gotcha. Such a good spell. Ice feast, baby. Here we go. Chardonnay uh, is going to have eaten it too. Yes. Can it, does it can it hit everyone? Is there a limit to how many people? Uh, twelve. Oh, That's why I'm wow. like, oh, we should have kept well, Jabba. Maisie asks around. if she should eat it. Oh, yes, this. Maisie should absolutely eat it. You're, okay. Maisie, you're in It'll on this make fight, you right? exhausted. Okay, but, but yeah. also. I mean, die. if you want to fight with us, we would be They're just proud to have stunning you. Stunning and okay, yeah, fire. yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll do it, but I'll just be a little tired. It's okay. <clears throat> you don't have to eat it if you don't want to, but it is pretty. It honestly tastes okay. Really? It's unseasoned. What's seasoned ice? You know, a little tagine. Tagine. Oh yeah, yeah. Little that makes sense. Tagine. Yeah. Oh yeah, like a like a snow cone or something yeah, exactly. like that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a blueberry syrup. Mm -hmm. That sounds yeah. great. Amazing. So you guys have those those benefits. You guys I know mean, what your new HP maximum. Glad in my heart that after years of fucking bullshit, I get to show you what I really think about the power of rage. He glows with red light pouring out of his mouth. He grows to about 15 feet in height. He smashes the floor with one of his feet. A wave of stun energy radiates across and all of you are immune to the stunning energy. Sorry, what did you just do? Loser says what? Oh, was what? That impressive? <laughs> oh! <laughs> <laughs> He is so humiliated, he gets nice. even angrier and ah, brrr, cracks appear in the wall. Oh, wow, that's cool. That's so sick. It's funny when like bad things are happening to us. And you're like, yeah. awesome. lava. This is cool. stuck to here, I think. Cool, and then we can leave that right there. That's okay. great for right now. Some of you that were getting total cover see that as these come apart even more, some visibility is like exposed. People can sort of see you and not see you. But Should I do a deck save or fall into the lava? Not yet. You don't need to do it yet. Also, um, let's see. 
straight up Beardsley energy. That was. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, Twelve. The Kramer of dice. <laughs> you can't call yourself. The Kramer of dice. And I didn't. I think it was good enough that you can. <laughs> Especially in that outfit. <laughs> <laughs> 43 damage. Whoa! Nice. <laughs> um, and then I cannot hide, but I would like to use the rest of my five feet of movement to completely submerge myself in lava. <gasps> That's right. OK. That's right. Oh, That's, right. That's, right. Yeah. That's right. Oh, I no! What's Kimberly going to do? That's what I was trying to get. I just swim. I just, exactly. you, I'm going to say, on the, me not understanding that Ice Feast would do this, yeah. you see Kipper Lily right here go, what the fuck? Uh, <laughs> I was trying to get, say I needed to do a deck save to fall in the lava. Unbelievable. Yeah. As Riz just <laughs> bloop into the fucking lava. Oh have, my god. Wait, this is only a hazard to my guys. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Why did I do this? You wrote the spell. It's a homebrewed spell. And then you reminded us. Don't them make up your own spells. <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. I'm sure it was a hazard to your guys. So we all said <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it is good to know. Yeah, that's We're all going to go down there and just really nice. fight Thank us you. in the lava. Unbelievable. Fight me in the lava. Okay.